So every year, one of the things everyone focuses on at Natural Products Expo is new food trends. This is one I've never heard of. Healthy stuff to drink like coconut water, whatever, it's a huge fad every year. This year, I've, I've never, how many years have you, you been here? We've only been on store shelves for one year, so not even cool. a year. So we've been at Expo, this, this is our second time. So are you the first We're company the like first. this? We're one the of the largest, first. Yeah. So it's maple water. So tell me, what what does that mean? It's exactly that. It's water from yeah. a maple tree. So basically, I went to right. high school in Vermont, you'd tap the trees for maple syrup, and then you'd boil down the water for like weeks or something. It's hours and hours and hours. hours? I mean, it, the would be days. days and days and days. We had huge vats. It depends today. on how big. I mean, if you're at home boiling down, it's 40 gallons of maple water. Oh yeah, we did a lot. To one gallon of, of, of syrup. Yeah, so, so it's, it's, you just take that water straight up. Yeah, the, I mean, the infrastructure's been there. We've been tapping trees, as you said, for hundreds and hundreds of years. The water that flows from that tree is what we are serving here. And so, one question. Uh, does it hurt the trees in some way? No. no. Um, it's the barely nowhere there. People think that the right. tree is a closed circuit like a human body, but it's not. The water flows vertically through the tree. And then what also, you have a whole mission aspect. Yeah. What's that? Vertical water comes out of a strategy designed by Peronia Forest, which is an award-winning B Corporation. Uh -huh. Its mission is to conserve American forests and reconnect Americans to the forest. Um, and our mission is to keep trees vertical. We have our own forest lands that we could tap for sap, and instead we make an effort to go out and include as many different sap farmers as we can, because the more stakeholders we have, the more impact we can have. Our huh. mission is to create huh. social, environmental, and economic impact, and deliver a great product. Love it. And in terms of packaging, which is a theme of our coverage this year, what are you thinking in terms of the most eco-responsible packaging? It's so difficult. It's a yeah. challenge that we faced from day one. It's something that's a huge priority for me when we were looking at bringing this to market. It's a, my background isn't in this business and my background is in, in impact investing and, and sustainability uh -huh. and cool. finance. So, but my passion is this and so that's why this exists. But we looked at glass, we looked at PET, we looked at different options. Why not glass? I mean, glass because of the maple, the maple sap. It needs to be packaged aseptically and the only way to do that, to give it shelf life or you do it in the PET with HPP. And so it's this challenge of do you leave it a seasonal product that's only available when the sap flows in the season, which is you know January through uh, April, or do you look for alternative ways? Um, and we also want to preserve the integrity of the product. You can uh, re put it through retort, and it gets very syrupy and, and sweet, or right. try and deliver the product. So uh, we, we've been working with Tetra and are and trying to figure out the best ways for them to become more recyclable as well. Have you made any progress on that with them? Or? We're so new in that we, yeah. this is only our, our sure. third round packaging, but it's something that we devote space to on our website and uh, communicate with them frequently about as well. I think you say it somewhere that the trees are absorbing carbon, obviously. It's part of the larger mission is yeah. how, do you, how do you use the resource of the forest without cutting down trees and how do you generate those impacts? Cool. And one of those products has been maple water and we've done you know, renewable energy and, and many other products. Love you'll it. find it all at verticalwater.com. Well, if you can get an eco-packaging, I will buy all of it in Boulder, Colorado. I love it. It's uh, one of the most over, interesting. Yeah. We're all over Boulder, so cool. um, we're in Whole Foods. And yeah, and the yoga food. demographic, we're pretty huge with them. They would love this. Anything healthy that's fun and has a good, and we love meaningful story. And supporting that community because it's cool. our life too. So, um, awesome. Well, congrats so to you, Valentina. Waylon, so great to meet you. Thank yeah, you good to meet you. Really Thanks for jumping it. in. Yeah, no problem. Beautiful booth, by the way. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs>